Good afternoon, Durham. I'm Rod Jenkins, Director of the Durham County Department of Public Health. Since we shifted to the orange or high COVID community level last week, there have been lots of questions about how community levels work, what this says about our cases in Durham, and when or if there will be a new mask mandate in Durham. Today's video is dedicated to answering these questions. First, how do these levels work? Community levels are tools to help understand how much COVID is impacting the community. These levels are determined by metrics the CDC created to measure both case counts and hospitalizations. It is not a measure of case counts alone. These number of cases in the community combined with hospitalization data determine each county's community level. More specifically, the community level measures case counts, new hospital admissions due to COVID-19, and percent of staff inpatient hospital beds occupied by COVID patients, all per 100,000 population over the last seven days. What does this tell us about COVID in Durham? Our case rate has fluctuated in the last weeks and was actually already decreasing when we entered the orange category last week. But because our case count per 100,000 population is above 200, the CDC's hospital admission limit to trigger a shift from yellow to orange is 10, and our new hospital admission rate moved just past this limit last week. This is what caused our move from medium to high. Our community level will return to yellow if our case rate moves below 200 or if our hospital admissions rate moves below 10. Finally, many of you have asked why I have not recommended that our city and county leadership bring back a mass mandate despite our community level switching to high. As our leadership and I discussed previously, I will recommend a mass mandate if we begin seeing consistent increases in case rates. At this time, this is not the case. This is, of course, not to say that our hospitalization data is not important. We are in ongoing conversations with the state and CDC to be sure we maintain a clear picture of the risk and severity of each COVID variant we face. At this time, indications make clear that case rates are the best metric for us to determine if a mass mandate are necessary. Please know that my team is closely monitoring all of our data on a daily basis, and as promised, if we do begin to see consistent case growth, I will recommend a new mass mandate, and at that time, our city and county leadership will determine if and how to establish this. We hope this message has helped to clarify some of the important questions we've received this week regarding COVID community levels and their impact in Durham. We are closely monitoring all COVID variants and case trends to make sure that we, alongside our city and county leadership, are making the informed decisions to help keep Durham safe. Although we are not at a point of bringing back mass mandates, it is clear that COVID is not over. Please continue to protect yourselves by getting up to date on your COVID vaccines. Staying tuned to CDC guidance and wearing masks and taking other precautions when necessary. By following these tried and true safety measures, I know that we can do this, Durham.